Banjaro Linux, a popular and user-friendly Linux distribution, has released an update to version 24.0.4. This update includes several important changes and new features that improve the system performance, compatibility and user experience. So, let's break it down. The kernel is the core part of the operating system that controls everything in your computer. The latest update includes new firmware, which is like a software update for the hardware inside your computer. This means better performance and support for more devices, ensuring that your computer runs smoothly and can work with newer hardware. Systemd is a system and service manager that starts up and manages services and processes in the background. It's been updated to version 2.5.6.1. This new version comes with many new features that makes the system more efficient and reliable. Think of it like a more organized and powerful traffic app for all the different activities your computer is doing at any given moment. KDE Gear is a collection of applications developed by the KDE community, such as file managers, text editors and multimedia tools. This has been updated to version 24.05.1, bringing the latest improvements and features to these apps. This means you'll get a more polished and future-rich experience when using KDE applications. Firefox, a popular web browser, has been updated to version 127.0.1. This update includes various bug fixes and performance improvements, making your browsing experience faster and more secure. It's like getting a tune-up for your car, ensuring it runs more smoothly and efficiently. QEMU is a tool that allows you to run virtual machines on your computer, which is like running a different operating system or software environment inside your current system. The update to version 9.0.1 means better support and performance for these virtual machines, making it easier to test and use different systems. Wine is a compatibility layer that allows you to run Windows applications on Linux. The update to version 9.11 includes a fix for a bug that has been around for 17 years, improving the compatibility and performance of Windows applications on Linux. This makes it easier to run your favorite Windows programs without needing a Windows system. LibreOffice is a free and open source office suite similar to Microsoft Office. It has been updated to version 24.2.4, bringing various improvements and bug fixes. This means better performance and new features for word processing, spreadsheets and presentations, making your work more efficient and enjoyable. Cinnamon, Cinnamon come to daddy! <laughs> is a desktop environment that provides a graphical interface for interacting with your computer. The initial updates to 6.2 series bring new features and improvements, making the desktop experience more modern and user-friendly. Several gaming-related packages have been updated to enhance gaming performance and compatibility. This means better support for your favorite games, smoother gameplay and potentially fewer bugs and crashes. These updates are like getting a new set of tools to improve your gaming setup. These are various utility packages that help with different tasks on your computer. Each of these has been updated to improve their functionality and performance. For example, Adjuster Helps in adjusting system settings HHD Manages hard drive operations Input Plumber Deals with input devices like keyboard and mice Power Station Help manage power settings and usage These updates mean these tools will work better, providing a more reliable and efficient experience. Haskell and Python are popular programming languages. The regular updates to these languages ensures that you have access to the latest features, security improvements and performance enhancements. This is particularly important for developers who need to keep their tools up to date for coding projects. Specific updates and information are provided regarding Python 3.12. This includes changes and new features that help developers write better and more efficient code. Keeping up with these updates means you can take advantage of the latest advancements in the language. 
AUR stands for Arch User Repository, a community-driven repository for Arch Linux and Manjaro users. It provides access to a vast array of software packages. The updated information on AUR packages ensures you can find and install the latest software, even if it's not included in the official repositories. The latest images for Plasma 21, GNOME 7 and XFCE 4 are available on GitHub. These images are like snapshots of the latest development version of these desktop environments, allowing users and developers to test and experiment with the newest features and improvements. The latest stable releases are available from CDN77, a content delivery network that provides fast and reliable downloads. This ensures that users can easily and quickly get the latest stable version of Manjaro Linux, which includes all the new updates and features. All around, the Manjaro Linux 24.0.4 update brings significant improvements across the board, from kernel updates that enhance hardware support to new features and system management tools, better performance in applications and updates to gaming and utility packages. This update ensures that your Manjaro Linux system is running smoothly and efficiently. Whether you're a casual user, a gamer or a developer, this update provides a better experience and more reliable performance. Thank you for watching, if you find this video helpful please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more updates on all things Linux. Feel free to leave a comment below if you have any questions or want to share your experience with Manjaro Linux. See you on the next one.